know, can I just say that this menu select music is kind of annoying? It just... It's way too repetitive, and even for a Mega Man stage select song, it just kind of bugs me. Oh well, it's far, far from the most important thing. Either way, hi! We're going to Comet Woman stage! Let's go! That's a very fancy pose you got. Alright. Ooh. Anti-gravity. Alright, this is probably good. This is a space stage. That would- Oh gosh! Laser mech! Not what I was expecting there. It's weird that I'm not having that we one charge issue that I was having before. I turned charge shotting on for the Whirlpool Man thing, and I guess it came back. What is this? Oh, oh, it's a, it's a spine. Ow! I was very confused by that thing, but now it's a, now I know it's a spine. It just wasn't moving. I need to grab this health. I like this music. Nice and invigorating. Oh gosh, it's a telly with a spike on it. Ow! I keep forgetting that these guys have lasers. Alright. So far, I've been enjoying all these stages way more than the first stage. Nail Man, like... For being apparently the one you're supposed to start with first anyway, and also for not me not knowing what to do. Probably not a- it was not a very good choice. Why can't I hurt this guy? And also, it's icy suddenly. Ice physics and space physics. It's an interesting mix you got going there. What are these- what are these sparky things like meant to represent- They seem kind of randomly there. I guess Comet Woman had like some sort of spark on her when in her little intro thing, so I guess it's just it's less of like a comedy thing and more of just a Comet Woman thing. I don't know. I don't trust myself, so cheating, sort of. It's only sort of cheating. I kind of last second noticed those death spikes. I was just being. Yeah. Oh, there's a checkpoint room. Nice. Ooh, I do not like ice physics and how they just. You don't have momentum. I'd be okay with them if it was just all sliding. Alright, so you can jump over that. God, that's hard. I'm gonna rush that because. Jeez, that's really... that's a little too tight, I think. I mean, things with underwater physics and... and stuff like that is... they usually have these kinds of tight... Oh god, Rush doesn't even help- oh god damn it! Rush barely helps you, and also I'm bad. Re like... I think it's a little too tight. Honestly, there's always been tight jumps in these kinds of areas, but... This is a little... Like I said, it's a little too tight. God damn it! It also bugs me that you can't touch spikes from the side. Not the spiky part. That was great. Well, I'm right here. <laughs> wow. I, I can't believe I just did that. I got a one-up, and then immediately jumped in spikes. Although, this probably was gonna happen up here anyway. God damn it, Rush. Not fond of that. Okay. That was better. I kind of like how you can't grab the ladders that are off screen. So you just kind of jump above the ladder and then and then start climbing. Oh, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Oh, I can shoot them.
Those met lasers are kind of tough. Have you noticed that I'm, like... Ow! God damn it, I need to do this again! This is gonna be the worst part of this stage, I guarantee it. Alright, let's just rush jet over this guy, because I don't want to have to deal with him. He's in a very inopportune location. Bye, Rush! Damn it! Damn it! After all that, and I just jump into the pit! Alright. Oh, hey, it's a full on E tank. Yay! I got it! Didn't really notice that uh, that one going around the sparky thingy. You kidding me? Really? You stupid spine! I needed that health! Well, I guess I don't anymore. Alright, I made it that time, and lived. Well, screw you, goddammit! Why do these spines need to shoot bullets? Just had to make them as annoying as you possibly could, didn't you? Well, you succeeded! <laughs> Honestly, all the enemies in this stage are kind of annoying. Tellies that can only be hit by one side, guys like those floating guys- OH GOD, THAT'S A PIP! I don't think I'm gonna make this. I didn't make it. Stupid tellies that can't be hit from one side! Alright. That's more manageable. Let's find out what our Robot Master is like. Okay, Comet Woman, how are you gonna play? Okay, that... that sure happened. <laughs> I was like really confused. Okay. Let's get our weapon out and ready. I don't know which... Well, the slowness of that fight kind of helps. She's not nearly as ex as fast as I thought she would be. Like, she, at, le at least we got the whole cold part of Comets right, but like, I expected her to be way faster than that. I expected her to be a spastic one, but she wasn't. She was just kind of, she was slow, and it was kind of weird. Oh well, I'm not really gonna complain too much. She was very fast, and that'll mean she'll, she'll be an easy rematch. You got the Comet Dash. That's neat. Alright. Either way. Next up, good old Jetman. So I'll meet you guys back at him. I can get through these now, I think. No, I can't. Uh, maybe the Comet Dash can get through them? No, what the hell? What the heck breaks through these things? I want to know what's in this room. Maybe it's one of the Yoku letters. I want to know what those do. Maybe they get me that ninth weapon. That I saw while doing Whirlpool Man stage. I'm really curious about that. What? I just kind of went through that platform. I 
hate this stage. This is so boring. Like seriously, I this is the bo most boring stage ever. It's so slow and tedious with all the shield attackers and constant waiting and the gimmicky platforms that are slow and just all well, the up and downs and missile things that you just need to wait for. Like, this is the stupidest stage. This is not a fun stage, especially one that you constantly have to keep playing when you do stupid things because there's so many pits in this stage as well. This is the worst stage in the game so far. Where's the Nailman stage? The only thing that was really frustrating about Nailman stage was the mini boss. You know what? Screw it. I have a billion E-Tanks for some reason, so I'm using one of them. Okay. Finally made it back to Jet, man. Oh, he does a lot of damage. Oh. oh, he was shooting a missile. I thought he was gonna come crash at me or something. Whoa, he's he's got like wind too. He's gonna be firing from that direction. All right, I got that moved down. I understand now what it's doing. Damn it! All right, so that's not horrible. Get the weakness out and ready. But if I use up all the weakness, then I'll just use an E-Tank when doing all stuff. I haven't bought any of them, so it's like... I'm not wasting anything, really. I'll be able to buy stuff later, because there's a shop. Yeah. Alright, so it's basically just dodges missiles and stuff and shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, this I kind of like this battle, actually. Now that I know how it works. When I first got here, I was really confused and also died in one hit. Ooh, that's a new attack. Well, I kind of ran into that last attack because I just kind of wanted to kill him, but other than that, it was no damage. I like Jetman. He's kind of... I think he's a good mixture of, like, pattern-based and also kind of tricky, because, like, if you mess it up, then you're gonna get hit and lose a lot of damage, but it's also fairly obvious what he's doing. I like that battle. Alright. And now... to go to Yo-Yo Man. So, I'll meet you guys at him again. Oh, wait, hold on, something's going on. I ran a few more tests. Okay, I accidentally skipped it. He ran a few more tests, that's it. Um. Alright. Okay, oh yo man, I might lose this, but let's see. No! God damn it! He does that much damage? Uh... What? God damn it! Platforms! I hate these stupid things. Okay. There! He's done! That was frustrating. 
but now we just have better and brighter stages in our future, hopefully. So, yay. Whew. I wonder what yo-yo weapon I get from this. You got... Yo-yo cutter. Oh, it's like a... It's like a weird combination of the shadow blade and the plug ball? I don't know what you would call that. Either way, I'm saving my game now. So I guess those mini E-tanks do add up to full E-tanks. Alright. I still have not found a single Yoku letter. Whatever that is. Whatever, next time on Let's Play Mega Man Unlimited, we're going to Trinitro Man. So, yay! 